One of the most fun you can have with yourself and people around you is just the gift and art of spontaneously breaking out into song and dance, whether you're singing something from a musical that's been established or just stringing together a series of words that you find fun, like foibles and poibles. It doesn't necessarily have to be a real word, but you can have a fun time doing it. And what this creates is an atmosphere where people can just be themselves and expressing themselves in a way that makes them appreciate the moment for what it is. And you're no longer worrying about, you know, taxes or paying the bills, you're just living in the here and the now. And a lot of the time you'll a lot of the times you'll find individuals who say, I can't sing, I can't dance. But the fun thing is you don't actually have to be good at it, or have the talent to do so. It's just moving your body in strange ways, and then even trying to say words in a melodic fashion, like the app for everyone who loves free coffee. I think that's a Starbucks one. Maybe it's not. Doesn't matter. But giving yourself the gift of song and dance with friends or by yourself is something worth investing in, because life is short. So you may as well sing and dance your way through it. So. That's a wrap for today. Thanks for tuning in. Tomorrow, Janine and I embark on our way to New York City, and right now we're staying with uh, cousins. Do you call it cousin? Yes, Daisy and Vincent. Super cool human beings. Too cool, but don't tell them because they'll get to their heads. So, yeah. But you, between you and I, top notch. <laughs> Toodles. <laughs>